Hey, 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 this is the boat doctor. A little wet out here today. I'm hitting in and out of the old rain showers. I'm already getting drenched. OR624A HG consignment, 21 C Ranger with T tops that are removable, rails, bow rails, stainless. Uh, these newer Remas, this is a 2021. I actually started riding really good and pretty good on fuel and very stable. They do have a little reverse shine to them. On here, you got a nice heavy duty, that nice frame on that. Galvanized trailer, swing ton, brake fluid. I added some brake fluid. A lot of them from factory don't fill them up all the way, so I filled it up just to check. You got your cables, check for cracks. If there's cracks in them, replace them because they're rotten from the inside out, they're rusting out. It's got a flat uh, uh, four or flat five on the trailer wires for the trailer brakes. Trailer brakes work good. You got load guides, about seven, eight foot. You got gear bath oil hubs, brown good, white bad. Net holders, plenty of cleats. You can never have too many cleats. Bulkhead door, <clears throat> plenty of room. That's one nice thing with your Rima. You shorten up the cutty and bring the whole cabin up so it gives you more room in back. Uh, uh, these uh, Rimas are real stable. You got a T99 with an autopilot Garmin Reactor 40 that's uh, controlled by the MFD or the display up front and also has a wireless remote, but it wasn't in the boat, so I didn't get to check that. You got 11 by 7. This has got the thrust of a 25. And there's the autopilot. Those are the them are the bomb when it comes to autopilot for kickers instead of the old TR1. Power tilt trim, stainless prop shaft, drive shaft on both of them, two coats of clear paint. Uh, both of them, uh, internal zincs. So these are total salt water protected. There's a little bit of the collar missing here, but that isn't going to affect how the boat performs. This is a 15 pitch right hand rotation. Yamaha 150, these 150s are powerhouses. Um, your oil drains right here. It's easy to do your own oil changes. Here's your motor stops. There's your uh, up and down. Uh, hydraulic steering. Probably looking at it as a C-Star. I could be wrong. I don't know. That's a U-Flex. Uh, anyway, uh, let me see. Uh, intake. Uh, it's got the fresh water flush on both of these motors. That one there. And you got one, I think, on the other right there. And that's broke, I see. Oh, no. They could fix it. Huh. Well, anyway, that's your water flow. So when you use those, you do not start the motor. Just remember that. Uh, start the motor, you want to use these. Always have water going to the motor. 2021, nice clean boat. Has the pads. This boat comes with everything. He's probably getting out of the boating business uh, because, I mean, he's got totes of stuff that goes with this boat. And here's a hard top, bulkhead, LED uh, rear deck light. Built-in fuel tank, it has a half uh, tank in there with your battery switch. And your batteries, these are just fish boxes. You can physically look to see how much gas you got in there. It's probably a 40 gallon tank. Electric downrigger plugs. Seats, make sure that's buckled up. Or if you sit on the front seat, it's gonna flip up on you. It's got Garmin uh, electronics, it's got VHF as well. Uh, he did it simple, that's what you need. You don't need all that fancy stuff, but sometimes it's nice if you're into gadgets. But very clean boat. All right, this is the boat doctor. I'll show you the rest when I'm on the water.